people, I have bought an oven. Not the one you cook in or make food in, but the one that heats up this place so I don't freeze my butt off sitting down here. So that means we can do Stock Clock Sunday and this guy. And this guy is a bit of a surprise because he's made of plastic. He weighs next to nothing. And uh, let's pick him for Stock Clock Sunday. No, no, no. That's not going to work. The lock picking part of me is an idiot and uh, the editing part of me wants to make it right. This guy, which I picked pick in this video, is a co-craft and uh, I'm bad mouthing it and I shouldn't. It is a very cheap lock with security pins. It is made, despite my uh, ramblings in this video, made out of solid hardened aluminium. It has a vinyl cover so it, that it doesn't scratch. It has security pins. It's rather precise and it is actually a good $7 lock. So, despite of my ramblings in this video, this is a good lock. You should get one if you can. Okay, back to the idiot that's picking this guy thing and badmouthing it. See ya! And the surprising thing is if you pay uh, careful attention to my tension wrench, you're going to notice that uh, I call this a cheap piece of crap. And I guess suppose it is. But unlike master lock, for instance, which don't put security pins in their locks as a cost saving measure, I guess. This guy, look at the tension wrench. This guy does have security pins. More specifically, it has spools in it. But as we all know, spools make it easier to pick the lock. Or at least more fun. Why would you make a lock out of plastic and then put security pins in? I don't know. But anyway, that is a white co-craft with uh, security pins in it and that stock lock Sunday. And hopefully now that I have an oven down here, I'll be back soon. See ya. Bye.